And we're back. <laughs> Alright, so uh, the next section of the catalog, and hopefully you're all able to follow along with me in this 102 uh, fairly easily, but it's personal care. So there are two items that were just put out by In Living that, of course, are not going to be in the catalog that we want to kind of highlight. And that is <laughs> oh, one of the puppies that were, were puppy sitting is a little bit of a barker, and that's okay. Uh, we're going to work with her on that, but so give us some grace. <laughs> But the first one is the insect repellent. So what does this do? It repels insects. It is 100% essential oil, okay? So that includes sesame oil, just so that you're aware. That is the carrier, um, the base. But as far as the active ingredients, there's citronella, lemongrass, rosemary, geranium, spearmint, thyme, and clove. That's what makes up this insect repellent that you can just put on and you're not even going to have to worry about insects at all. I'm, I'm really excited. The tests that we saw done where they, um, they, the way that they test for mosquitoes. Okay, they actually pay people to stick their arm in this box that is full of mosquitoes and they don't use any insect repellent. Like they just, they stick their arm in there and then they count how many mosquitoes land on that arm in, in, in you know, a certain amount of time. And it's not like in and out. It's, they have to leave it in there. And I just, oh, looking at the pictures, I died. So. There were hundreds of mosquitoes yes. on that bare arm. And, um, and then they would test, of course, the Young Living insect repellent. And uh, it performed beautifully. And then, of course, they have to compare it to another, uh, whatever would be on the market. Okay, they have, they have to compare it to other brands out there. Okay, and so they did. And um, the Young Living Insect Repellent actually performed 30% better than the comparable brands that are on the market. So... Considering that the mosquitoes out here can pick up small children and carry them away, uh, we're really, really excited about this insect repellent. And uh, like everything else, it tells you exactly what's in the product on the label. It also tells you what is not in this product, and that is DEET, parabens, fillers, phthalates, <laughs> fun word, uh, sulfates, petrochemicals, animal-derived ingredients, synthetic fragrances, or synthetic dyes and colorants. They also don't test on animals, so the testing, like I said, it was done on a human arm attached to a human body, and they had to endure getting bit by bugs when um, they used either no repellent at all or they used other comparable brands not labeled Young Living. So. Get some of that, right? And then, mineral sunscreen, okay? This stuff is great. Yesterday we went for a walk, and I put a nice, like a normal amount on my face, and then I just kind of rubbed what was left on the rest of my skin. I should have actually put more, because you could tell, like I got the back of my neck really, really good. And that tanned, my face looked great, and then my shoulders and my chest were like bright red at the end of the day because I didn't actually have any, you know, I just kind of did like that. You know how you do when you're putting on sunscreen. And I was like, okay, I should have been smarter because my face was fine and the back of my neck was fine. It was just where I didn't actually have anything on my fingers that was not fine. So this stuff actually, it works really, really great. It is SPF 10 which means that you can stay in the sun 10 times longer than usual, or that 10 times longer than you would without, with, and before you get burned. So let's say uh, for this one, you need to reapply it every 80 minutes or more often, all right? It is um, water and sweat resistant for up to 80 minutes. So that means that if you can go out in the sun for eight minutes before you start to burn, then you can technically stay out in the sun for 80 minutes before you'll start to burn if you're wearing this. Does that make sense? That's what SPF 10 
means. So you reapply every 80 minutes. Um, and we walked four miles. Four miles? I couldn't remember. We walked four miles yesterday when I put this on. So we were out in the sun and it was like just beaming down and it was mainly, you know, the front is is what was getting hit. And like I said, my face, not a single burn. It didn't even look like I had gone out in the sun. My chest was a whole nother story. Uh, it is feeling better today though. <laughs> I don't I don't stay burnt very long, but this stuff works really, really well. Because um, normally my nose probably would have been a complete crisp. So yeah, get that. And again, <clears throat> all ingredients on the back, just like everything else. So, moving right along. Oh, that seems good. Logan heard you. It's like you're drinking Zing without me. All right, so the very first part is art. So this is their skincare line. And they have actually quite a few really nice um, art products. I absolutely love. So this is the foaming uh, face cleanser. And I'm almost out. I got to refill. But I use this every single day in the shower. So every single morning when I take my shower, I use this to wash my face. And it has lasted me over six months. Yeah, because we got it free in our... Yeah. It was before Christmas mm -hmm. when we got this. Yeah, we got the whole collection for free in, as part of a promotion. And this has lasted over six months with everyday use. So this lasts forever. Um, this is their the light moisturizer. And because I was using it in the wintertime, it's actually, this is empty. I go through it um, up faster. <laughs> Um, but again, mainly I think because it was winter time in the summer, I think this would last all summer because you don't need to uh, moisturize quite as heavily in the summertime as I do in the winter time. However, I really love the way that this felt. I'm very funny about what I put on my face. I don't like putting stuff on my face and this felt lovely. Actually, everything from Young Living has felt lovely which is surprising because if you were to like hand me a tub of Noxzema or something, I'd like scream at you. Um, and then this is the refreshing toner. And again, this actually, this is still here. This, this is still full and I've been using this since we got it. So these products, they last forever, forever. And it is, it smells like peppermint. It feels great on your skin. It helps to kind of, you know, clean out and close up those pores. So absolutely fantastic product. And then next is Sheer Lume. So this here, and then we're gonna go on to uh, what they have for other stuff. So that's Sheer Lume. Now this, oh. Um, that is what Lume it looks creamy. like. Yes, and this, because you know, you saw me wash my face with that uh, baby wipe. So it is, very, very easy. You just I dot it. And then and my face feels great. I absolutely love this moisturizer and I bought myself that moisturizer for Christmas and we just got a new one so that lasted about five months um, so actually then we've had the art for even longer than that yeah. we've had it for a really long time we never got it on ER yep because when I ran out of the light moisturizers when I ordered my first tub of the uh, Shirley May. So, yeah, we've had it. I had it for probably nine months. So as you can see, Brent touched my face. <laughs> I was half expecting me to smack it. <laughs> Slapped his baby's butt. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So then they have a whole lot of different facial care. Um, I love that they have like a Wolfberry eye cream. They have all kinds of really nice stuff, which um, I don't think. 
and we're not there yet. So, oh, there it is. All right, so next is Rose Ointment. And we love it. So I got a tattoo last month. And I actually used rose ointment. As you can see, we really we we go through it, and we have another tub of that somewhere. I think it's upstairs in our bathroom too. So we have two tubs that are partially used in the house. Um, it healed up that tattoo amazingly well. It is great for any dry skin, so elbows, knees, your heels. Um, anything you, you can even put it on your face I used to get really dry right in there and then across the chin and it not anymore so I absolutely love that um, next is the hand and body lotion yep Genesis okay you have to try the Genesis hand and body lotion you just have to it smells amazing it does it does and it's, it's super thick, thick. yeah very very thick we love it absolutely love it and it's got msm in it so it's really really good for your skin and then next is shower gel bath and shower gel and now for bath and shower gel and the shampoo any of them you can put them in a foam bottle to make them last longer now, I like to just put a drop on my loofah and wash away, but you can easily make those. They're all super concentrate, and so they're going to last a really, really long time. Next is bar soap. Bar soap. Okay. Oh, finally got it. So I am not the biggest bar soap fan in the world. I would much rather use a shower gel. That is until we got Young Living Bar Soap. Now this is the Valor Bar Soap. It smells so good. It smells so good. Um, yeah, their bar soap, it lathers up beautifully and it keeps that mm. luxurious velvety feel while you wash. Mmm. Okay, nobody's getting samples of this. Sorry, you're gonna have to buy your own. <laughs> um, I love though, we've tried several of their bar soaps now. They are all absolutely fantastic. So I would definitely um, that right there, add it to your essential rewards. Totally worth it. Totally worth it. Next is their deodorant. So they have a deodorant that's called Aroma Guard. I will tell you. I've struggled with deodorants my entire life. Actually, I've struggled with body odor and deodorant not working my entire life, okay? And when we joined Young Living, I was like, great, I'll use essential oils. You know, it'll totally take care of this problem that I have because I can't use any perspirant. No deodorant I've ever bought has actually ever worked for me. And so I was putting on essential oils, like coating myself in them to help with that body odor issue. And it helped a little, but I'd have to constantly reapply. And then I tried the toothpaste. Everybody said the Thieves toothpaste. And now I love the Thieves toothpaste on my teeth. I did not like it as a deodorant. I'm not knocking the people who do. I think it's great. But I sweat it off immediately. And I happened to try it when working at uh, the chapel. And so I, was, I had sweat pouring down a black uh, long shirt. And with the white outline. It was not pretty. Um, so... <laughs> I was really excited to at least try the Aroma Guard deodorant, and when I did, no odor, none. I apply it once a day in the morning, and it lasts me the entire day. And I don't have to worry about aluminum, because there is none in there. There are no toxic chemicals in any of their products, and my skin, my armpits, love it love it and trust me I'm one of those people like I get really bad everything swells up and yeah not fun so if it was bad my body would tell me and it is not bad at all yeah, we love the uh, the mountain mist yes. that is the, uh, the one yep. that mountain mint mountain mint there we go <coughs> I'm losing my voice so next Brent is the cool azul pink one. Cool Azul Pain Cream. For when you have an injury or you're working out, uh, mowing the grass, weed eating, anything where you hurt yourself, 
and you need some relief without all the uh, toxic byproducts that are in other products. Uh, get yourself some Cool Zool pain cream. And they just reformulated it, so it's actually going to be stronger, which is really, really exciting. They just released that today, so I cannot wait to get mm -hmm. our next bottle of Cool Zool. <laughs> um, that's going to be awesome. Next is Shutron. Yep, do all the Shutron and then we'll do Pro, Pro Plus. Okay. Shutron, the outstanding men's cologne. The cool thing about Shutron is, is that it, the smell comes different from... Let me re-say re that. <laughs> the smell is different on each guy that puts it on. Like when I put it on, she smells valor. Mm -hmm. When my neighbor puts puts it on, his wife smells cinnamon. It's just, uh, it's kind of weird how it all comes off. Yep. Um, when uh, buying a regular cologne, uh, cologne there's usually uh, between 40 and 60% alcohol in it, where this is 100% therapeutic oil. Mm -hmm. And you're not going to get that in regular cologne. Along with other products, they've got the shave cream. Uh, I've heard some people say that it burns a little bit when you're putting it on, but I haven't had that problem. And I use it uh, almost every day. It's very smooth. Very smooth and creamy. Oh, that is creamy. When, uh, when coming out. Uh, one of the other products that I left upstairs is the lotion. Uh, you put it on afterwards and it leaves your skin uh, really nice and moisturized. That's why it's been so nice. I've noticed his skin, he has dry skin and his face has just been fantastic lately. I was wondering what you're doing. Yes. <laughs> it's like he's stealing my shirt with me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the last product is going to be the beard oil. And this smells amazing. Mm -hmm. And it comes in a dropper. So you can either put the dropper directly right up to your face, or you can put a couple drops on your fingers. And rub it right into your mustache. Gives you a, a, a nice odor to smell all day long. Mm -hmm. And then it keeps your whiskers nice and soft. I know during the winter time especially, uh, my mustache gets really uh, pokey, and this keeps it from uh, from getting that way. Which is really nice for me. <laughs> I'd also like to say that the beard oil has a very nice price point. So if you're loving the Shutron products, but you're not necessarily sure about paying the Shutron price, go for the beard oil and try that out first even if you're not growing a beard mm -hmm. um guys can put it in their hair you know so like this their the hair on their head it's not just facial hair and you know try it out see how you like the smell and then go for the shoe which you know like he said that you're paying for something that is way better than cologne at the grocery store or at the you know whatever at the mall no. <laughs> i know you're not getting cologne at the grocery store um, so yeah, totally, uh, totally worth it. And next, we're actually going to talk about Progestins Plus. Now that, right there, is Mama's Helper. It's actually great for any, uh, woman. So any female who is considered a woman or in that stage of life. So not for children, for women, okay? And it's going to just help with all of the the hormone balance that we need. Um, the way that I use it is I just, uh, every single day, I put three drops on my forearm and I rub it in. And something that I have noticed, a nice benefit, is my skin absolutely loves it. Uh, so, I just make sure I get it on areas that might need a little bit more love than others. I'm, I'm really good at burning myself in the kitchen. And uh, that's like a daily thing for me. So 
I am sure to cover those areas when I put on my Progestins Plus. All right, so next is hair care. And that the they have the most amazing shampoo and conditioner I have ever used. As you can see, I get um, I tell people this is my natural color. Um, but but it's it's not. And in order to get this beautiful vibrant purple and blue, uh, there's a lot of bleach involved and you know, it's quite quite a process. For me, it's totally worth it. I absolutely love, that's Logan, um, I absolutely love, you know, getting my hair done this way, but it can be really rough on the hair and on your scalp and just, you know, everything. Our kids have come back inside. Uh, I don't know if you can tell, but my hair is, is absolutely, it's soft. It is pliable. There's not any fried areas. You know, it it is healthy. I have very healthy hair for somebody who has been bleaching it for well over a year on a regular basis and then putting in um, different colors. So you uh, will love their shampoo and they have a variety of them. This one is just the, this is the Copaiba Vanilla Moisturizing Shampoo. That works really, really well on my hair and then they also have a conditioner uh, we have the Lavender Mint Daily Conditioner. Uh, it's fantastic. And from what I understand, if you put that in your head, if you have, you know, some, some dryness issues, put it on and leave it on for like a while. And then rinse it out later. Or just put in a thin layer, like right before you get out of the shower and just leave it in and it will help your scalp. So, fun tip. And again, you can dilute um, both of those. Oh yeah, the shoe charm. I almost forgot about this. This came out uh, at convention here in uh, 2017. This is the Shutron, uh three-in-one body wash. It uh, works amazing. I put it on my loofah, and it suds right up. It uh, smells amazing. Yep. All right. Next is Oral Care. Now they have an amazing mouthwash. They have got. Um, Floss, I was trying to think of it, they, and they also have a few different toothpastes. I'm sure you can see that there. So they have a couple different types of toothpaste that you can pick from. Uh, don't ask me what my favorite is because it, it, you know, it's really, every month we try a different toothpaste and I love all of them. I will say they are all fluoride free. That is really important. Do your own research on fluoride, but uh, I love that their toothpaste is fluoride free. My mouth loves that their toothpaste is fluoride free. M the uh, increase in health has just been mind blowing. Uh, we don't have to worry about going to the dentist uh, more than what is actually like recommended. It used to be we were going constantly. We were always having work done on our teeth and on our gums and you know I was at risk for gingivitis and for all, all kinds of crazy stuff. That is no longer an issue for me. I only have to go to the dentist for those cleanings and um, I've been told I can actually I can bring my own toothpaste so that I don't have to use their fluoride filled toothpaste and uh, still get my teeth polished. Our kids' dental health has greatly improved. Every time we go, they're, you know, kids, their teeth are tight and they don't floss and they don't brush very well and everything, and yet their teeth are doing amazing. And we all use the Young Living Toothpaste. What else have we got? I think that was it. Did we cover everything? Wow. Uh, yep, that is it. That is it. All right, so we've just gone through the entire 2017 product guide. In the very, very back, it does tell you how to share Young Living, and that, of course, is a whole nother class in itself. Uh, if you're interested in the business at all, then just let me know, and I will be more than happy to help you start sharing Young Living with your friends and family. Um, but yeah, I think that that's it for this video. We're going to make our closing video, and we'll see you in a little bit. Bye.